climate change is part of the baseline assumption of what we're looking at in the future. And that's a very new paradigm on how we, uh, how we conduct uh, long-range planning and how we evaluate project alternatives. The big picture objective for this study is to develop and uh, demonstrate a framework for determining or evaluating what climate projection information should be considered in a given planning study. So a water resources uh, planning study or an environmental planning study. So it's about choosing the information that you use in a climate change study. Well, we have a partnership with Reclamation and Army Corps of Engineers as well as NOAA and we are trying to provide um, access for water managers to assess and interpret climate change information from climate models. I've produced a database as well as a um, web tool that helps users uh, navigate through a system of menus and make plots of climate change information. So people can look pretty quickly at what the climate models do compared to the observations. Uh, climate models are really cumbersome, the, uh, lots of data to sift through and requires specific software to analyze, so this web tool makes it real simple to just select things from a menu and create plots. Uh, so that's a big piece of it. And then on the other side of it, we're putting together a, a pilot workshop based on the Central Valley Project in California. Uh, so we'll have a, a very detailed sensitivity analysis of that system and what that system responds to. And then we'll sit down with um, somewhere between half a dozen and a dozen key planners from the Mid-Pacific region. And we'll walk through a mock scoping session. We want them to be able to focus on a region of interest and look at what climate change impacts are happening in that area. We'll actually get a better understanding of how they can use those research results and apply that to the next step, which is conducting actual uh, project-specific studies in support of uh, very tangible decisions. So we do envision that other scientists would be able to use this. The research is being done specifically to address a very uh, tangible need. Uh, and in, in many cases, uh, there is time pressure to get that research done and to get an answer so that somebody can make a decision. And that's, that's a very unique uh, place to do research.